beautiful, it's Darby and welcome to my channel. Today I have my February Ipsy Glam Bag and I know this is a little bit later than I usually get this video out by, but I actually just got back from the Dominican Republic about two days ago, but I still wanted to show you guys what I got in my bag. So if you're interested, then just keep on watching. So if you haven't heard of Ipsy before, what it is, is you spend $10 a month and they send you a package which always looks like this, it's so stunning. And what it comes with is a cosmetic bag with five different products in it. So it's only $10 pretty much $2 per products plus a cosmetics bag and it's just fun to try out new products so if you are interested at the end of this video to pick up your own Ipsy Glam bag then I'll leave the link down in the description bar but let's see what this month's theme was. This is hashtag Ipsy much love and then the package this month wasn't very cute honestly. Um, some may think it's cute, but honestly, I probably won't be using it, so I'll give this one away as well. But it says Ipsy on the little tag here, and then it's just kind of a denim fabric. So let's open it up and see what we got inside. So my favorite product of this month is by Marsh Cosmetics, and this is the Cine and London line. This is in the color Your Toast, and it's a mineral eyeshadow. So it is absolutely stunning. I'll show you a little close-up of it but it is a mineral eyeshadow, so it's a loose eyeshadow, and what I do is just put a little bit of Fix Plus on my brush, and then I just stick it in here, and it applies so smoothly on the eyelid. I have it on the inner part of my eye today, and it is gorgeous. It's just a nice kind of champagne, kind of gold color, and I'm absolutely in love with the first product. So the next thing I got in my bag this month was actually a makeup brush, which is awesome. It seems like pretty good quality. This is by the brand Luxie, and it's a blush brush in the number 514. So I did use this for highlighter today, and it worked pretty good here. And I don't really wear blush too much, so I won't get too much use out of that, but it seems pretty nice for highlighter. It wasn't too compact, so it kind of just spread it out nice and evenly and nice and light. So I'm digging this so far. It seems like a pretty good blush brush because it's not compact So you don't want to put too much blush on and have like two big red cheeks So it's just nice that it's pretty light so it will kind of distribute the product nice and evenly So this was a pretty good one as well It's so funny every single month. I swear I get a highlighter which I'm not mad at this one is by Luna Cosmetics and it's the shade Calypso. So when I first got it, I tested it out on the back of my hand and I thought it was a little bit chalky and I wasn't too sure and it's kind of a light purple so I was like, oh, I don't know how this is going to look. But once I applied it today on my cheekbones, it actually looked pretty good. So. It was a decent highlighter. I have better highlights than this. I have way worse highlighters than this. So I actually thought this was quite worth it for like $2. For my next products, I got an eye pencil and this is by Rodeo and this is just a nice pigmented black. And I'd say this compares to the Marc Jacobs one, which is staying, saying a lot because this is probably only like $2. And this is really pigmented. It glided on really smoothly. I put it on today in my waterline and the top of my eye there so I mean for spending like two dollars on this I think this is so worth it and last but not least we have two face mask sheets so I was super impressed that they actually gave the two because that actually means that there was six products in the bag this month so this is by the brand so AE I'm not too sure how to pronounce that but the first one I got was this nature collagen essence mask and this is the green tea one so I'm super excited to try that and then this is the one I'm really excited to try this is the purifying black charcoal mask this is for hydration and moisture and why I'm excited to try this one even though it's a sheet mask I've heard so many good things about charcoal masks did you see those like sponsored ads on Instagram where that girl's like peeling off the charcoal mask the black one for blackheads and you can see all the blackheads just like peel out of your skin I don't know I get like super satisfied by that like staring at the little blackheads after you pull it off I have one of those like nose strips that you pull off I do it maybe like once every couple days because it's so satisfying seeing all the blackheads coming out of your nose even though that's so disgusting for some people but I'm like obsessed with that I think it's so like oh it's so satisfying but super excited to try these two masks super impressed that they gave two instead of just one for the fifth product so excited to try these and once I do try them which will be tonight I'll leave it down in the description bar how I liked them 
And as I said in my last video, with the points you can get from reviewing products or if you sign up a friend or whatever, you can build up those points to actually get more products. So I got two other products in my bag this month and I was supposed to actually get a third one and my bag was actually like opened. It looked like it was like open while shipping and then they like taped it back together. So I hope they didn't like take a product or one fell out, but I emailed Ipsy and hopefully they'll sort that out. But I got this Tarte um, Maracuja oil and I've heard so much good stuff about this. You put this either in your hair and the tips or you can put this on your face as a nice moisturizing oil before you go to bed. So I'm so excited to try this and it seems like there's actually a decent amount in there. So that is the first one and then this was like two good brands, brands that I'm absolutely obsessed with. This is by Saint Tropez, so it's an instant glow body lotion. So you put it on and it gives you a nice instant glow if you don't want to do like the full fake tanning routine. Then if you want, you can just before you go put this lotion on and it gives you a nice glowy shine to you. So I'm excited to try this one out as well. And I mean for, I think this one was like 250 points. This came with so much product in it, so I'm excited to try this one as well and I'll leave it down once I do try it in the description bar how I liked it. So those were all the products that I got in my Ipsy Glam Bag for the month of February. I was really impressed with all five, well, six products and wasn't too impressed with the bag, but that's okay. And I was really impressed with the two products I got with my points. I think those are well worth it. So if you guys wanted to pick up your own Ipsy Glam Bag, it's only $10 a month. I'll leave the link down in the description bar. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give it a like. It would help me out a lot. And if you're not subscribed to my channel already, I adore you if you subscribe down there so you're notified each time I post a video. And thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I love you so much for watching and we'll see you next time.